Good morning, and welcome to This is Another Day. Today's scripture reading comes from Isaiah 54, verse 10. For the mountains may depart and the hills disappear, but my kindness shall not leave you. My promise of peace for you will never be broken, says the Lord who has mercy upon you. You only need to read the news headlines to know that the earth is shaking and the world is in serious trouble. From deadly military coups to mass shootings to children left unprotected and vulnerable, the unpredictability and chaos of national and international events strike us again and again, leaving us unsettled and anxious, terribly isolated and sad. Our suffering produces deep emotional intensity, and we lament with the prophet Isaiah when he says, My eyes grew weary of looking up for help. But the intensity of God's mercy and promise of peace cannot be invalidated or canceled out by the world's grief. The Apostle Paul in Romans 8.32 encourages us when he says, Since God did not even spare God's own Son for us, but gave him up for us all, won't God also surely give us everything else? This is another day to hold on to God's promise of peace. Civil rights activist Thurgood Marshall, who served as an Associate Justice of the Supreme Court, said, The measure of a country's greatness is its ability to retain compassion in times of crisis. Christ's compassion shed upon the world through his death and resurrection is the basis for immortal, unfailing, and unrelenting hope. So Lord, all around this country and in our world, mountains are shaking and walls are crumbling for so many, especially during this pandemic season. Help us today to pray for those making decisions that affect our most vulnerable community members and grant them wisdom and compassion to do what is right by those you call your own. Thank you for being with me today, and I hope to see you again. Bye.